Hello and welcome to Star Inside News. Today we are going to share Wendy Williams back in rehab for substance abuse issue. Wendy Williams has checked back into rehab to treat her substance abuse issues amid her fallout with production company Denver Mercury. Page Six has exclusively learned it's gotten worse. Our source shared she went from wine to straight up vodka. It's unknown where Williams is receiving treatment, but she previously sought help from centers in Florida and Long Island City, New York. We are told William health and addiction issues worsened after her former daytime talk show production company allegedly refused to get her help. They turned their backs on her. Our sources now explain they had too much control over someone so vulnerable. William ex-husband Kevin Hunter previously claimed to pay six debt. Demar Mercury wouldn't engage in any behavior that would take the shock jock 58 away from her once iconic purple cheer. Wendy William is seeking treatment in rehab. Dimbar would not support Wendy recovery effort with the family, Hunter told us in July. They wouldn't sign off on anything that would have helped her recovery efforts. Hunter 50 further claimed that William family attended an intervention of sorts with Demar Mercury, during which he and the group discussed how to aid Williams in her battle with alcoholism. They sat in a meeting with her whole family, including her now deceased mom, and wouldn't sign off on the recovery effort that would have helped Wendy also get well and live and be sober, he told us. They basically said, if you don't stop drinking, you are going to lose the show. It gotten worse, our sources say. Concerns surrounding Williams' health and wellness resurfaced in early August after a former radio host claimed she was married to an NYPD officer. Things are really off. It's not the same, Wendy. She regressed like crazy and her family in Florida is very worried for her. A source told Page Six at the time, amid the drama in her personal life, William's public life was also suffering as she entered a public battle with her bank. Wells Fargo, after she became locked out of her accounts in response to the drama, her former attorney claimed in a lengthy statement to Page Six that William's former financial advisor, Laurie Schiller, left her to die. William is also embroiled in a lawsuit against Wells Fargo. Shiler never responded to the claims. William battled substance abuse since the early aughts of her career. She got sober and remained so until she appeared to relapse in late 2018 or early 2019 at the time she went on hiatus from her show for two months but claimed it was to treat her graves disease. She later coped to entering a halfway house to help maintain her sub- sobriety. Only Kevin knows about this, not my parents. Nobody, nobody knew because I look so glamorous out here, she shared of her treatment center on her show in March 2019. After I finish, finish my appointments, I am driven by my 24-hour sober coach back to a home that I lived in the tri-state area with a bunch of smelly boys who have become my family. Williams' rep confirmed to the U.S. Sun that the How You Doing host in a wellness facility to manage her overall health issues. If you like the video, kindly like, comment, share and subscribe.